Hey everyone, it's Graphic Back with another video, and today we're going to be talking about the most expensive furnishing items in New World based on aesthetics, rarity, popularity, and price across all servers. So of course, we did talk about recently the top 15 most valuable items in New World. This is talking about millions of gold in some of these items. Well, today we actually are going to talk about the furnishing items that we missed in this video. Because there's no real price history among some of these, I have actually been able to get a list from Jezgran. If you guys see here, he actually has a Reddit post that explains the Brimstone update and how it added these extremely rare furnishing sets that you might not even have heard of. The chance of the game picking an item from the Elite Furniture Bracket is 1 in 20,000. Brimstone has 69 furniture drops, and if you want a specific item, the chance is 1 in 1.38 million to get that exact item. So here are the different furnitures that uh, or sets that are out there in Brimstone Sands, and there are nobody with you know pretty much all of these at this point. They're so expensive to buy on the trading post if you know what you have. So make sure you're not undercutting yourself and underselling. Let's go take a look at what we could be talking about in the top 20 furnishing expensive items of New World. So the first one we have in line is going to be the Pirate Anchor. The Pirate Anchor is going to be one that sells for right around 85k. This is after, by the way, looking into the price across many different servers. I did see one when I was looking this up on Aru for 45k right now, so it could fluctuate quite a bit. Remember all these prices because there is not very many of them on the market. So they'll go up, they'll come down, they'll go up, they'll come down very, very quickly. But 45k for this pirate anchor at the very least. Some are saying selling for about 85k. Next up in the list, number 19, we have the brass telescope. So the brass telescope is very, very rare. You can see here on Aru, the same place, selling for about 100k as well. So this does sell right around that 95 to 100k mark. So it's not surprising to see the brass telescope right there. Next up on the list, we have the white gold place setting. So let's take a look here. The white gold place setting. This is going to be one that is selling for much, much more. It's at 190k. This is a huge, huge price for something that's so simple and so small in a house. And it's crazy to see that the market for furniture items has continued to skyrocket for some of these very rare pieces. So we're actually not going to find a single one on this uh, exchange right now or the market price right now of any of them. But 190 k is about where it's been selling here recently. Here we go, Jade Painted Bamboo Blinds. So this is actually what we're going to be looking at. And we can see that there's not going to be any on the market yet again. It's so, so rare to have these. So when you have them, you typically sell them outside of the trading post. However, you can see that the Jade Painted Bamboo Blinds are selling for right around 200 k Next up on the list, after the Jade Painted Bamboo Blinds, we have the Golden Steel storage chest about 250k or sorry 215k gold for the schematic itself um, we don't really know much about the gold steel storage chest when it comes to the actual item or the furniture because you can see here it's about 3.2k but like i said the actual uh, the actual schematic itself is what's going to sell for that 215k gold for this golden storage chest. So let's take a look at the schematic. Here you go, 100 or not 100, but 388k on El Dorado is the sell price. You can take a look at Isabella, 150k Valhalla, 240k Bari, 220k. Uh, Aru doesn't have any, but you can see that this price is not going to be undercutting. Uh, much lower than where it's at right now, 215K, according to our price sheet. Next up, we have the Mediterranean set, furnishing set with some schematics. So 215K gold per schematic and item. This is a set that has done very, very well when it comes to money making. Uh, let's take a look at the Mediterranean set. These are all the Mediterranean sets pieces here, the woven rug, the concrete stove, the curtains, etc. If we look at the uh, the let me pull it up here, the actual schematic itself. So let's look at the stove, for instance, see if we can find any of those on the market. If not, I'll give you the price that we currently have. So the price for this one is, like I said, 215k per schematic slash item. Next up, we have the large stone brazier. 
This is 220K for the schematic yet again. The large stone brazier is something that a lot of people have been going for or eyeing recently. And if you look for the schematic, you're probably not going to find it anywhere again because they're going to be selling it in trade chat. Trade chat, there's no taxes when you sell and buy and exactly why people use it for high priced items. Next up, we have the deep silver set. The deep silver set is going to be a huge piece that a lot of people want to take advantage of because it's got, well, let's see here a lot of money per item. It's 225K gold per item. So the deep silver set, the oil lamp, the deep silver hanging oil lamp. There we go. This is just one of the many items. And this one sells, like I said, for 225K. They also have the exact same thing going for the, let me take a look here, the burnt copper set. So the burnt copper set is one of those items that is also selling for so, so, so much. Uh, we take a look at the burnt copper wall brazier, 225k a piece. Typically, is what you're going to see here. You see on Marama selling for 180k as the sell price, and uh, you know right around that range, you're going to find uh, you know a lot of others selling for that exact same price to 180 to 225k. Next up, we have the white oak set, another set that's selling for per schematic. By the way, 230k. So white oak set. This is one that a lot of people are liking as well. So let's take a look at some of these schematics, see if anyone has them on the market. Doesn't look like it, but like I said, around 230K for this one. Mirror patterns is next. Mirror patterns is one that a lot of people have been looking at as well. Let's take a look. Nobody's going to have this one on the market most likely as well, but this one is going to be selling for that 230K. So that's another thing to recommend is... You know, you're not going to find these on the actual market themselves if you're looking to buy. So make sure you're on that trade chat and you're actually going to be able to see what people are trying to sell these for because you may be able to undercut and then post them again on the trading post or just back into trade chat. So mirror patterns, 230K, not too bad at all. Next up, we have the walnut set. The walnut set is actually selling for right around that 240K per item. So you can see here there's a bookshelf one of the many items in the set, it's going to have a 240K price point according to the price list. Next up, we have the Lazolite set, another set that, like I said, a lot of people just don't have yet. And because of that, the price is continuing to be at a very, very high 250K per schematic. So right here, you can see the dining table at 5K. That's why you need some of these schematics sometimes because the schematic itself for that same exact item will be 250K to actually grab. All right, next up in line, we have the tea serving set, which you would think a tea serving set, that can't be too much. Well, no, you're wrong. 275K per tea serving set. 360K here is the sell price on Marama. Um, we won't see many others, I wouldn't think, but Marama does seem to have a lot of the furniture. Wow, wow, wow. That is a very, very low price for the tea serving set. Surprised nobody is picking that up. This does, like I said, they we've seen many of them sell right around that 275K gold mark. So great to see, actually, the El Dorado, a steal up on the market right now. Let's take a look at some of the other ones. We have the Influential Set, the furnishing set without schematics. So Influential Set. Let's go to some of these here, the seat itself. Let's see if that's sound for anything. Again, not finding most of these on the market because of how expensive they are. People aren't going to sell them on the market most days. We could see 300K per item is the price of any of these pieces in this set right now, it seems like, which is a lot of gold. Next up, we have the Amethyst Marble Set. The Marble Set is a cool one for sure, and it's selling 350K per item. 350K for the Amethyst if I can spell it here, marble, dining table, and others of the set, 350K is a lot of money. And you can see here on Marama, it's actually selling for about 50K, which is huge. But we've seen these sell around that 350K recently, so that could be a heck of a steal for anyone interested. Next up on the list, we have the short black porcelain vase. This is going to be an interesting one that a lot of people wouldn't assume, again, is worth that much. Well, you'd be wrong again. This is a 450K vase that you're going to be looking at here uh, or we've seen it sell for that price seems like marama always has them on the market haven't found them on the market in quite a while when it comes to these porcelain vases but this is like i said 450k across most servers most 
realms. So if you guys are looking to grab it, it's going to cost you quite a bit. Next up, we have the carved statue of Jupiter. This is a massive moneymaker because it's going to make you about 750k gold for the actual schematic itself. So let's go to the recipe carved statue of Jupiter. You can actually see the schematic and this will take us to some of the different servers. None of these are probably going to have them listed because remember this one sells typically above that gold cap at 500k. It's going to sell for 750k, which is quite a bit of money. Next up we have number 2 bonsai centerpiece and you guys probably do know what number one is if you think hard enough a lot of you guys have probably heard of it but number two like i said is definitely worth mentioning because it sells for about 800k so this is a huge huge deal 800k for something this simple in the middle of your house so next up we have the goldfish in a porcelain bowl this is the one that is number one of course on our last list and I had to make it again today to make this list complete it's one that a lot of people have talked about recently because it sells for almost a million gold across almost all servers and that's because it is such a recognizable piece in the house at this point and it's so so rare to get as well and uh, who doesn't want a goldfish in their house as well? So very, very cool. I do think, like I said, this is going to be a very, very good list for a lot of you while you're looking through your pieces of furniture, not to get rid of certain ones. Hopefully you guys don't get rid of these as they're worth tons and tons of gold. And I want you guys to be rich on Eternum. So thank you guys again for tuning in. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel and turn notifications on. I'll see you guys all in the next one.